When deciding between Android and iOS, one of the things that Android advocates will boast about the most is a high amount of customization and control that you have over your home screens. This is certainly true, but if you're a first time Android user, it can often be difficult to figure out just where to start with the whole customization process. So let's figure out just how to get the most out of your Android home screen setup. I'm Joe Marin from Mobile Cup of Joe, and before we go any further, please go ahead and grab that coffee cup, fill it up, bring it over, and sit on down. And take a swig from your mobile cup of Joe. <laughs> To take the first step in customizing your Android home screen, you're going to have to download a new launcher. Android launchers are essentially apps you can download that replace your current home screen setup, and also give you additional features and customization tools that you normally don't have on your phone out of the box. The launcher we're going to be downloading today is called Nova Launcher. You'll be able to accomplish all of what we're doing today with the free version, but I highly recommend ponying up the $4.99 asking price for the Prime version. Once you have it downloaded from the Play Store, go to your settings, select Home, and then choose Nova Launcher. Now that we have the basics down, you want to figure out how many home screens you actually want. Personally, I use 5, with my main one right in the center. To add, subtract, and rearrange your home screens, hold down on any blank space of your setup. From here, you can hold down on a home screen to rearrange its position hold down and drag it up to delete it. To make a certain page your main home screen that you'll go to when you press your home button, touch the house icon above the page that you want. When you're done, touch the back or home button to get back to your setup. Next, let's start customizing our pages with the apps and widgets that we want. A good rule of thumb is to populate your main home screen with all, or most of, the apps that you use on a daily basis. I have eight here in my Nexus 6, but you can absolutely add more or less depending on how you use your phone. Moving over to the page to the right of that is another setup of my secondly most used apps. I have 8 here once again. Some of these I do use once a day, but not nearly as often as the ones on my main home screen. To the right of that I have a page set up entirely for apps and widgets related to work for Mobile Cup of Joe. My two leftmost pages are dedicated exclusively to widgets for my calendar, notes, etc. As you've seen on my phone, I've got widgets on every single home screen for my setup. The widgets you have available on your phone will be dependent on your downloaded apps. To see all the widgets available on your phone, hold down once again on a blank part of your home screen, but this time touch the widgets icon towards the bottom. From here you have a vertically scrolling list of all the widgets currently available for you to use. The widgets are grouped by which app they belong to, so it's easy to find just what you're looking for. Once you find a widget that you like to use, simply hold down on it, and then place it on the page of your choosing. With Nova Launcher, you even have the ability to completely resize all of your widgets. To do so, go to an existing widget on your home screen, hold down on it, and touch the resize icon on the pop-up menu. From here, you can touch and drag the four dots to adjust the size of your widget right to your very liking. And there you have it. Those are the basics for getting the most out of your Android home screens. It'll take some time to find just the right combination of apps and widgets that do work for you, and you're bound to go through many different setups before you find your sweet spot. Having clean, structured, and organized home screens may seem like a very simple thing, but once you find a setup that works for you, you'll be absolutely amazed at how much more enjoyable it is to use your device.